With East Stroudsburg head coach Denny Dowds at the conclusion of the annual spring game. Practice over for the spring, 15 sessions of scrimmage. Your thoughts uh, after this spring set? Well, you know, we came off a great off season. Our kids worked in weight room, they worked in the conditioning, they worked in plyometric and speed programs, and we made some significant strides in that area. They took that over when they hit the field first of April, and they just continue to do that. We didn't have a bad practice. I mean, that, that's a tribute to the guys, and we're young, and they got a mature attitude about playing the game. So it's going to be fun to watch this gang and see what happens. You talked see about you. the maturity, lack of, you only have six seniors. How do you coach a young group like this knowing that at any moment they can really come to fruition and be a really dynamic team? Well, the, the methodology of coaching last year, we had all the young guys, 67, retired freshmen, pure freshmen. That was a little different methodology we applied to coach this, this year. We have some young men that are maybe young in their classes, but experienced in game experience. And so therefore, that's a little different. That's that's a big time plus for a coach, because usually you, you, you nurture them along, and by the time they get to be juniors and seniors, they're stepping forward. These guys step off and they're freshmen, and sophomores, and so now it's, it's going to be fun to see those guys work hard, and they know we got an opportunity. And that's all we ever ask, is get an opportunity to reach your goals and aspirations, and we have that this team coming back on August. The brunt of your experience on offense is in the passing game. Very deep at receiver, talented quarterback. The running game, completely new. How does that affect you? Well, you know, we got some young backs. They got some talent. Uh, those guys, you know, they, they, they're they good pedigrees. It's a matter of just getting them some experience, give them the opportunity. We've got a couple other guys coming in. So we'll have a good stable of running backs that will we'll be prepared to be able to, to grind it if we have to. And we've got two fullbacks now. They're, they're both of those, Tibbet and, and Benson. They're good-sized kids, and they can they can run the ball and catch, and also they can box the people down. Defensively, you got Brian Thompson, player of the year in the division defensively. Veteran line. You move some guys around in the secondary. How is that part of the ball coming? Well, we're, we're, you know, we, we have developed some guys in the secondary. We've also recruited extremely well in the secondary. So the competition will be certainly key when we get back to key. And uh, there's some people that still have an opportunity to make the team that might not be with us. And there are some kids that uh, still, if they own their skills, that they with us now, they got a chance to start too. So I know one thing, we're going to be highly competitive in the secondary. Can you give an estimate of maybe how many jobs are still up for grabs when you come back in August? 22? 24. Including the kicker. How significant is that for player development to have competition, to have a second string pushing the first string? Well, it, what it does, it never settles. That's a person that's settled in the comfort zone. You got to compete every time. You got to be out there on the edge. You got to be able to, to take that step. You got to be able to do it in, in a in a mature fashion. You say, what do you mean by that? I mean, that means coming out of the locker room, each practice, working to get better, not just uh, just say, hey, I got to put in two hours to go to practice. I'm talking about going to practice and saying, I got a goal today to make sure I can become the best I can possibly be, or improve maybe my weakness, so therefore I can make a greater stride to improve in dealing with that. We do that as individuals. And now you start to do that as small groups, offensive line, defensive line, uh, secondary, receiver core. Now you put those together with the offense and defense and special teams. Now you raise the whole level of the squad, too. That gets pretty exciting. East Stroudsburg coach Denny Dowds concluding still another spring practice.